Well, just stop for a second with Mr. Munch. Let's see if I can show you here. Let me see. See if we can see it. It looks like smooth clouds over there, right above the mountain. That's the big fire toward Lottle Creek and Mount Baldy. That's a big fire they've been fighting. Yeah. You can't even see down in the valley. It's so smoky and so hazy because of the fires. Yeah, welcome to Southern California. Look at that. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, big helicopter up there. All right, I'll talk to you in a bit. All right. All right, all right, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hang on, hang on. Well, good Saturday morning to you. It's certainly not... Not Big Bear Lake, but it's closer to home. Yeah, today we played it smart. We brought Mr. Chair. We bought Mr. got Mr. Zoomish. No candies. We have a plastic bag in case it. Uh, we have thunderstorms today. Keep the camera dry. Uh, we have parallel camper. Rob, we have your hat. We have to have your hat. Next to a helmet, this is the most important thing. Uh, Mr. Chair and uh, Mr. Stanley with ice cubes and Gatorade. We're good. We're good. All right, let me, let me turn things off here and get things going. We can yak. All right, now it's a little cooler now than it was last week. Yep, 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 all right. Let me get Mr. Chair set up here. We'll talk. Um, got a few updates about Mr. Munch's rear brake cylinder. It's dead. So I looked online, if I, was, if I was to buy a Suzuki, from what I see, if I was to buy a Suzuki OEM factory Rear wheel cylinder, uh, brake cylinder, be around $260. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. So I did some research, and it looks like we can, oh, well, actually, I already did. We can buy a, a rebuild kit for the master cylinder. It's a whole $23. I hope, hope the parts work. It basically consists of seals, um, maybe an O-ring or two. And so I ordered it yesterday. So, yeah, in the next few days, we'll have a rebuild kit for the rear brake cylinder for Mr. Munch. Yeah, nice to have, nice to have some brakes, you know. Don't need the rear brake, but when you're in the habit of using it, it can get you in a tight spot sometimes. Mr. Stanley here. I got upset. Look at this. Look at, look at that damage on this thing. I said, what in the world would cause that? Well, there's a, a vent in the back of the uh, that box. It's a screw, and it ended up beating this up. Is this what life has turned into? <laughs> no, I just love being with you guys. I love you hanging out, hanging out together. All right, hang on, we'll go up the hill. So anyway, we'll take uh, Mr. Stanley up to the up to the hill here. Ow, I got stickers in my shoes. Hang on. one thing about tromping around in the woods up here that you get those little those little stickers and thistles and thimbles and thimbles in your socks see if i had a, a good pair of boots i do have riding boots but they come all the way up to my waist almost i just need some some good high top boots mine are worn out who cares huh all right 
Hope nobody comes up here while we're here. Not that we wouldn't welcome them. But it's good to hang out just with your friends. All right. I'm going to take you out of here. Uh-oh. It's actually a little bit, not chilly, but it's nice. It's actually cool up here. I could actually, uh, temperature-wise, I could actually uh, have a long sleeve jacket on at the moment anyway. That's... Yeah, this... Not like last week. Last week was something that I mixed up. What a concoction that was. Tasted, it was lame. This, sugar-free Gatorade. Real, the real McCoy. It's made by a real company. Yeah. Got those goofy swallows flying around here again this morning. It seems to be the only bird up here that you see is these swallows. Speaking of swallow, you know, I don't want to be rude. Here, here. Yeah, it tastes all right. So I fished around and I found uh, through Parts Unlimited, they sell motorcycle parts. I found a rebuild kit. And so it has new rubber pieces within the kit. And I think um, some new, a new O-ring of some sort. So I received that. We'll be taking the master cylinder apart and see if we can rebuild it. Hopefully nothing mechanically inside is broken. You know, hopefully the, uh, the piston in there is okay. I hope, I hope. So we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, it is actually, it's actually a little bit nippy when the sun goes behind. I don't know if you can see those swallows or not. They just, they don't, they don't light anywhere. They don't stop anywhere. They just keep on flying. All right. Man, it's, Nice and nice and cool right here. It's almost nippy. 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 <laughs> All right. Yeah, breezy too. Not not good for the fire. Um, the fire is still down toward Lytle Creek, so it's windy here. A little windy. Hopefully, it's not windy down there. So it's it's sad when it gets hot. People set fires. People set fires. And so it's just sad. So welcome to mankind. That's sin nature. You got to fight it all the time, huh? Yeah, it's just getting ready to say that I haven't seen that helicopter that you saw in the front of the video. I haven't seen it. It came in twice, um, but I haven't seen him again. But just this minute, he flew over, but he didn't go... He didn't go across the way to get water this time. He just flew straight over. Before we go, let me hang out here a bit. We'll see what we can find. All right. Love you guys. If I don't say goodbye, I'll talk to you soon. Have a great Sunday tomorrow. We have, uh, I'm excited. Another church service. Two of them back to back. Looking forward to it. All right. We'll talk to you later. Love you guys. Bye-bye. No, no, you can't. You can't drink this. Yeah, you can't burn it. Mr. Munch.